start. Or in our midst 
that can bring the hindrance. It is our sincere prayer, Lord, that you will take it away. And also, Father, when our dear brother also comes again to stand here to minister your word, take a hold of him and let what we do in his pocket here, let it only be the oracles of God. And Father, take everything else, any aspect which is not of you, out of him, and be the one who is taking the center stage to speak to us. Father, may it be so spoken in such a way that when you come out of this place, our hearts will be burning. And we'll be like the people who are going to a mouse who say, did not our hearts burn within us when he spoke to us along the way. Amen. We are a church and we are people. <coughs> and always when we come here, we confess that we love you. Yes. Great King, may our love to you be strengthened more and more. And as we come with various needs also before you, the needs of your children, which are different, very, very different. Father, for each and every one of us, with the desires that they have in their hearts, now that they have come into your presence, may you meet with them and answer every desire of the heart of those that are here before you and even those that are far off. Maybe will be listening to streaming, but they have desires in their hearts. Come and be with us, be in our midst, and may your blessings and presence be ready. For we ask this in Jesus Christ's name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. God bless your brother. Uh, for not starting to give us some sense. God bless you. Dr. Oma, this moment. Dr. Oma, this moment. Timber speed speed. Come a Sunday school to combine Sunday service and Sunday school. Number 502, 502, when Jesus comes to the Lord's servants. When Jesus comes to the Lord's servants, 502. Kuna Haja, Kuna Moja for me. Atakama hujui ni haja gani Yuhu fulani mini anama Dada fulani anaesa kuwa nayo Weo omba tu blindly Omba Somehow your prayer Will talk me Especially I think I need I need more prayers Na nene kwa kia wase Nikitoka kwa hii Kwa kwa hii Na nikaba shetani anakafuta Ni maali gani wiku Maali kuna wadaifu kwa huu ndogo ambao na usanishu wa nae right now I'm breathing a handache but I must I must breathe it shetani hirudi kwa hivyo it's not my handache it's not my handache so let's pray for one another let's pray for one another David and Ali Fraisha, the way he's catching up in this place. When Jesus comes to reward his servants, when the red been known, no, no.
the Great Tour of this morning. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Uh, welcome to today's service. As we open to the Bible, to the book of Amos chapter 3. Well, we read on Friday. We read just a small portion of it. So let us pray. Our precious Heavenly Father. This morning, Lord, we are assembled here in one accord, Lord, the body of our Lord Jesus Christ. Father, knowing that the prophet said is the sickest body that he knows of. So our minds, Lord, might not be thinking the right thing. But we are praying, Lord, by your transforming power, that you may change our mind, Lord, to be tuned to your spirit. Because it's the spirit that, that leads your children to his word. Help us in every way as a leader push of your word. I want to commit this service this morning in Jesus, in your name. Knowing Lord that we will not leave this place the way we have come. We will leave this place as better children. In Jesus' name, Father, I pray. Amen. Amen. So Amos chapter 3, we read only verse 3. Amos from Wainatu. Can two walk together except they be agreed? You may have your seats. Uh, we started this someone of spiritual amnesia. And we realize it's a condition where people don't know who they are. They forget their family name. They forget what their family does. They forget their father's teaching. And they don't know left and right. They are hopeless. It's like that man, Brother Branham, uh, visited him. It's the man who visited Brother Branham and was very angry. And he asked for some food. And Brother Branham gave him, uh, uh, some, gave him some bread. So where he was eating, Brother Brahma says, man, and where are you coming from and where are you going? And he said, I'm coming from nowhere and I'm going nowhere. <laughs> and he said, how do you live? Just like that. And he said, where my heart will fall? Yes, that is where I sleep. This is somebody who has no forward, no backward. He has no ambition, he has nothing in life. And you can imagine a person like that one. And Brother Branham was talking of a person who, who was with him. And he said there are so many people, Christians, who are like that. That they are like uh, drifters or, 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 or that they are taken to whenever the water will go. It has nothing of its own. So it's a bad condition. Amen. Amen. And we heard that. I want to, I, I, I will take very, 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 I will speak this sermon very consciously and I will not be in a hurry. 
I don't mind preaching eight a year. As long as God will give me strength. Until you know, because it's very difficult to explain to you that you're out of your mind. Because you think you are thinking. You think you are right upstairs. Now, to explain to you that your mind is not working well, I don't know what to do to your mind. How many understand what I mean? <laughs> so, and Brother Brown gave two examples on Friday. And I talked of a man who had two sons. And he had an instructor or a tutor. And the tutor told the father, one of your sons. Nothing, nothing to find. Nothing to know. Why pray and God knows? He said even there is only God who intercedes for us. He's aware. Even one prayer in the morning can cater for everything. Is that not our condition? There was some boy like that. But the instructor told the father, this is sad. If you give him anything, he will sell it. He will sell the farm. He will sell the car. And exactly that's what he did. And he wasted all the money that was given. You might not say man because to begin with you are sick. So you don't, you don't understand, you are sick. I say, oh, I can't be in a hurry. Until we realize we have to be sober and in our senses. Tell me, let's be honest. Why come to church? And you waste your time and come and sit there. And what is spoken is God wants, and you don't punctuate it. The way your father told you, the way the Holy Ghost told you, you should do. Why waste your time? And you know, when you don't do that, you are not in the service. Why? You won't, you, you won't tell me your opinion. But I understand. I am talking to sick mind. Because Brother Branham said the sickest body is the, is the church. So there are God knows we are sick. At least. So the father knew that this young man is sick. He has some amnesia in his mind. And because of stubborn spirit, they agreed with the mother to, so that we can have peace. Let us give him anyhow. And it will be the way the tutor said. Now, so he went, sold everything, and he went a fuck out. And he ate all the money. He stopped going to church because there was coronavirus. Don't think you backslide that time. You backslide it when you stop coming to the church. So you better repent. Oh, 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 he steals you out. There is no compromise on this. It has to be God's word, and somebody has to say the truth. Don't think because you have come to church, you are doing God any favor. You are a backslider. 
If you have not repented of anything, remember God is you are not in the program of God at all. You have to repent so that you can get into the sequence or to the program. Anything you do wrong, you have to repent it. To be back in the program of God. Yes, amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Yes. Yes. So this young man went and spent everything with luxuries of the earth. Start trying to do this kind of a business, this kind of a business. It did not work. And all the money was gone. And so he looked for a, a small job somewhere. And I said he had no good qualification. He left the tutorship, he left the school before graduating. So, so, he had, so he had to take care of swipes. And God made sure. Because what you sow, you reap. Amen. Amen. If you are sound of God. Oh, yes. Amen. 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 <coughs> Put a television in your house. Amen. You reap what televisions, you know, what television bring forth. Amen. I tell you, Amen. I tell you, Amen. I don't care whether you put it in your bedroom, whatever you put. You reap. Amen. Amen. I hear you are buying televisions. Not for streaming, but for luxury. You, the luxury will kill you. You are dead. You are dead. What a life. Nonsense. Amen. People are sick, completely sick, and out of their mind. I don't care how many degrees you could have. What for? Yes. Amen. How can two walk unless they be agreed? Which means they have to listen together. That's what God said. Come, let us listen. Listen, then the mind must be right. So this young man, God is good. He makes sure you reap what you sow. You know what happened? He got a very bad employer. Gave him money that was not able even to live by. A very corrupt employer. Mm. I think that the player seems to be like Kenyan government. <laughs> who pays very little to the unworking people and he gives people who sit down for nothing and they are paid for sitting. Mm. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Somebody, somebody who is helping the lives of innocent people, they are eating tea, a, a tea of millions. When they cannot buy the, the suits for the nurses and doctors, what kind is the same employer? Same employer. <laughs> Hallelujah. Yeah. So this man, he had an option. He had to start corrupting. So the match was given for the soil. He had to give them with the ratio so that some can be easy. <laughs> <laughs> you 
You can imagine oh, yes, yes. eating <laughs> pigs' food <laughs> until every evening he could not sleep. Because the intestine of a human being cannot know what has come inside. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Human beings don't have the same intestine like the pigs. <laughs> so this man, you know, all this time he was sick. So he, was, he did not know whether he was eating strange food. But the stomach could not allow. So he said, to avoid all the time problem of stomach, and there is no money for, 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 for the hospital. What I'm going to do, I'll look for another job. I'm, I, it's better I get a less paying job but with a good employer. Then, then he remembered that in where he left there is the father who has his embroyers or, or, or embroyer and he doesn't treat the way he is treated here but then, how can I go back there? when he was thinking about that because of the conditions he came back to himself. The amnesia left him. And he said, I will go to my father. I will, uh, uh, no, I will go to that employer. Tell him, one time I was your son, and you are my father. But this time, I've come to looking for a job. Please allow me like an employee. Because I know here, they treat, you don't treat people the way I'm treated, the way I'm employed. I finished my, 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 my money, which was here. But still, you have something small for employees. So allow me. But the father was not sick. So he, he had never forgotten this is his son. Is that right? But look, there is another slave. Not even a good person, a slave. But his father was a king. A 12th man king. Is that right? And he was kingdom. Kidnapped. Nah, nah. And, and, and they were taken to America from Africa. Nah, I get America from Africa. And then, 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 then there's somebody who went to buy a slave from from the a man who had many slaves. And he looked at. He said, "Before I buy one, let me find out which one I want." And the said, just like we go to buy a car. And he found one. He found one that was not sad like the rest of slaves. His chest was open. He was bossy. And he was strong. So he said, I want that one. He was told that one is not for sale. Sure. But he asked why. Do you treat him differently? Is he, but is he the boss? Is he the supervisor of the other three? He said no. Do you give him food separately? No, do they go? Do they do you have summons for others and summons for others? Because they are not behaving the same. He said no. 
But this one, I also took time to learn that this man from where he comes from his father is a son of a tribesman king and, and when he came here he behaves like he's a son of a certain tribe mm. That's how he behaves. And Brother Abraham said, if a slave can be able like that, mm. because where he was born mm. is from a king of a tribe. Mm. How much more should Christian mm. who are born of a heavenly king? Mm. So because we are sick, let us uh, no, we cannot walk together with God. Mm-hmm. Unless first we agree. Mm-hmm. Can you agree? Mm-hmm. So in the spiritual amnesia, but I'm not saying, there is a place when you get this amnesia. You might get like Nebuchadnezzar. Mm-hmm. It was who exerted himself one time and, and, and God let him think he was an animal and he lived out in the wilderness and eat grass like an ox and his hair grown down his body like eagle feathers and he had become the heart he had became the heart of a beast in him See? that was amnesia because he had forgotten that he was a king you can imagine somebody who was sitting on this road a king mm. hallelujah yeah. Waking up to the seat okay, or, the, yeah. or, the, or the throne, and then instead of walking like upright, like a human being, yeah, he, he walks up and walking like an animal. Okay, and he started eating glass. Okay, and he started walking like an animal. Okay, and, he, and, and his body became like, uh, 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 like a goat, so much hair. So Brother Abraham said, why that happened is that he got sick in his mind. He forgot who he is. He had forgotten he was a human being. He thought he was an animal. Can you imagine that confusion? There's no face. Sijui kama hiyo kitu inaingia. Ati mtu amesahau kama yeye ni mtu anafikiria yeye ni binadamu. Hii akili imeenda wapi? Mondo no riganirwe. Kana yeye ni mondo. Akambia woishiria ni nyamu. So he acted like kanani. Kogo ekireta nyamu. Because he forgot he was a human being. No no riganito kana yeye ni mondo. Then after brother Abraham talking about the Nebuchadnezzar he said that's so is it today. That we forget sometimes that what the Christian church is. And we act like the world. And that shows that we got spiritual amnesia. Because that you don't act like the Christian. You act like the world. You receive the heart of the world. And it causes this. Why you act like the rest? You have received a heart of the world. And you want the things of the world. But Abraham said, but when it comes to the power of Jesus Christ and his resurrection and the Holy Ghost, these people that are sick, 
They want nothing to do with it. Because it condemns them. It condemns wearing you are the, the, the tight clothes. And bringing films in your house. Brother Bram said, old timers did not go to watch cinemas outside the market. But he said the devil. To sterilize the generation. He removed those films from the market and he brought them in their house. In form of television. And one thing a television will do. It will make the minds of people be so much disturbed one day as you walk. You say, ah, yeah, yeah, somebody is eating you, and it's you is seeing it, you. Others don't see what is eating you. You see things coming from, oh, ah, yeah, ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Television will make the minds of people to the end to be like that. Television will make the minds of people to the end to be like that. Because the name, you know, it is not that thing which is the evil. It's not the object, the TV. It is the program that the devil is inputting there. That's right. That's right. So, people don't want anything to do with the Holy Ghost. Because it will condemn them. Sure. It sets it set them a fire with the key, with the thing that they ought to know. Um, it sets them a fire with the thing that they ought to know. Um, oh, Roma, they do no more canabia, no more two hours, no more than a promise. So, no chastisement, of course, is present for the season. Now, we did a cover on a canaju. Uh, is that right? Yeah. But it, when you are warned by the word, you are being chastised. Yeah. But it's a it's present for a season. Uh, no, But you should thank God for that. Yeah. But yeah. It, give your youth to it. Right. It brings the fruit of repentance. Amen. So we find out when this spiritual amnesia gets a hold of the people, they are in bad condition. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. And you must be identified somewhere. You must show where you are identified. And your life shows tonight where you are identified. You are identified either in Christ or out of Christ. You are not hungry. There is no such a thing as drunk shopperman. You either say there is no black, white, bad. You are either saved or you are not saved. You are a saint or a sinner. 
we mudure we mudarie kana kore mwepi one or the other ah umwe kana ore ngi and your spiritual attitude na moshere wa kuwa kero towards God's word identify you exactly where you are studying amen moshere ni wa kuwele kana kio kanga hii ni kuona nagia rogamete ba and God's word na kio kanga hii vindicate proved and this is spirit, I'm reading from spiritual Malaysia just get it and God's word vindicated proved that the baptism of the Holy Ghost is just the same it ever was on the day of Pentecost or any other time so it's still difficult to argue with these people because they are sick they must come first of all to the cognition they are sick and their mind be transformed then we can talk otherwise he sees you are not seeing and, and you you know he is not seeing because he is sick and how do you know it his action proves now if you say receiving the one is holy ghost and then you cannot be identified with that one you can't go to church because there is corona you can't take communion because there is corona where are you? your action will prove you are sick so your attitude and Jesus Christ the same yesterday to that friend and, and your attitude towards that identify whether you have spiritual amnesia or not. That's right. No matter whether it should be a deacon or even you are a preacher, it doesn't make They get it too. Pastors get amnesia. And you get off the road. And you leave your papas. Because you get off the road. And you still you think you have adopted your deacon. So anybody can get it. As long as he is not in the sequence. Amen. 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 Now, then, in the same message of a spiritual place, how we must be identified. And he said, I'm American. And to be American, I must be identified with my nation. To be an American, when I am born here in this country, I become a citizen and I am identified with this nation. To begin with, you are identified by birth. Oh, it is. I am. And all that it has been, I am. For I am identified as an American. No, no. Then I have to take all the its shape. Sure. You remember when Brother Branham was arguing with that doctor from France? Mm. Is it France? Mm. Yes. No mm. France. When he said, I cannot get to a sauna where a nurse come to, you know, to, to do something to a man. Amen. And nurse. A trained nurse. Then he was told that he saw in Paris. Or in France. But in your country, America, mm -hmm. if that is shame, you are women. 
I strip naked on, on, on a bed and they are examined by men doctors in their private parts. Did he refuse that? No, He said, I am not going to go. He said, That is what happens. I only I don't even remember that quote Missouri because he says the the the, the, the what for goose is good for dance. Is that right? Mm -hmm. So he was saying, you know, that's how it is in the land. That's why he's saying he is also identified with the shame of his nation. And also he is together identified with the glory of its nation. So whatever it is I am because I am identified with it. And I want to get it. I want to get it. What, what, is, what, is, what, is, what, is, what I want to get it. What this nation and it's entitled for me. I should get it. In other words. Whatever this nation, the nation, I am identified as an American citizen. Um, they don't want you, bro. Down in the motor to America. Then all it was, I am. Nakira kyo nde vorishu anakorwa. All it is, I am. Nakira kyo nde ori. I must be part of it. I am an American citizen. Ne. I am a part of America. So all what American is entitled for me, I am part of it. I should get it. If they give good housing, I should have it. Good health, I should have it. It's I am part of America. Brother Abraham said as he traveled around the world, he was getting injection for yellow fever every time. But he was saying, I don't need it. Yeah. But it's a rule in America. Mm -hmm. uh, he had to be identified with that. So I must never forget this. I must never forget this that I am an American. And there is what Americans behave. There is what is called America. If I want to remain a true American citizen, I must remember that I am what my nation is. For I am identified with my nation. To forget her or to fight for her or to die for her or to stand for all she stands for, I must stand for it. Is that right? He can defend it. What my nation is, I am. What it stands for, I stand for it. And you explain what you mean by that. Nah. To be a loyal American. Nah, I must be ready to die for it. Fight for it. Stand for it. And do anything there is. Why? I am part of it. You can't pick on it without picking on me. When you say something against it, you say it against me for I am an American. I love this. I love this. To say it, to say it, to say it against you, Americans, and what they say against this nation, they say against you for you and for you are part of it. Yes. So do you never forget it? 
When you do, then you got amnesia, sure enough. Remember, you are no more American citizen. You are no more American citizen when you can become part of it. Because what America is, you must be also. I must be partakers of it. Then he says now to be an American. I landed on Primal Rock. Uh, with her with the forefathers he knew he was not born yeah. but he claims to have been among us those old men there yeah. maybe in C4 I had it too I am part of her. I rode with the poor river to warn her of her dangers. Uh, if I am a real American citizen, I landed on Plymouth Lock. I closed the eyes in Delaware with George Washington with his barefooted soldiers. George mm. Washington. I was, I was there, for I am identified with this nation. What she did, what he did there was part of me. Yeah. Washington, and what I do now is part of him. I was identified with Washington and the Dalmere. Uh, Dalmere. Where? Where? Yeah. I stood with the Stonewall Jackson. When the arms were so great, I can see. Uh, and they asked, how can you stand like a stone when the arms is against you? And the little bashful, blue-eyed fellow kicked this dust with the boots and he said, I never take a drink of water until I thank Almighty God for it. I have to I have to stand like a stone wall with him. I stood there with the Stonewall Jackson. To be an American, I am identified with him. I hosted, I hosted the flag. I was with them when they hosted the flag on ground. And after thousands of American soldiers give their life. Uh, and when that little group ran up there and drew the flag up, I was identified at the raising of that flag. And because he was talking to America, he said, and everyone of us was. All American citizens was identified with, with that flag hanging of a car. Yeah. Uh, 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 
Why? Like, when they had that, they had put that flag up there. Tears ran down my cheeks. That was me. That was you. America. America. That meant to us all when we was identified there with that. Oh, she is, I am. Oh, glory is my glory. Oh, shame is my shame. Oh, she has done. Shame things, then I have to stare her. Stand her reproach. And one of my man is shocked and one if she receives glory, I receive glory with her. Because I'm identified with her. Now, that is a, a true America. Then he gave that to America. Then he came to Christian. Are you following? Are you following? Are you following? Are you following? Are you? To be a true Christian, like a true American, you have to be the same. Yeah. You don't have to forget that. Yeah. All that was, I am identified with him. All that he was, I am identified with him. Notice, and he is in me, and I in him. Notice that every Christian that's a real genuine Christian was with him. Mm. When the money starts, mm. some together in the sense of God shouted for joy. Before there was a foundation of the world. Were you there? Yeah. We were identified in the motor ribs with God. Amen. Amen. Ten, ten millions years before the world was ever formed. I was back there with him. If I got a talent, I was there with him. I was identified with him. When the morning stars sang together and the sons of God shouted for joy. You are not shouting for you don't know how he shouted. Hallelujah. Amen. I was with him when he called Abraham at the age of 75 years old. I was with him. Amen. And he is why I've been 65. Yes. And he told him they were going to have a baby. Amen. I was with him Amen. when he took his stand upon that says the Lord. Yeah. I'm going to have the baby. Every, every other Christian stood with him. Yeah. I was with him when his temptation came. Yeah. I was with him when he went on top of the mountain yeah. to offer up Isaac. Yeah. If you were with him yeah. to go to offer Isaac, you can offer anything to God for you have the same experience. Yes. I was with him when the lamb appeared. Yes. I was with him with Joseph mm. ah, to be identified. Yes. When he was rejected of his brothers. Yes. Because he was spiritual. Yes. And the rest of them was carnal. Yes. Yes. I was with him when he, when he known the reproach he had to stand by his own brothers. What he was, I am. What I am, he was. For we are one in Christ Jesus. I was with Joseph in his grave. 
I was with him when he went to the right hand of Pharaoh. I shared food with him. I was with Jacob that night. When he rested all night with an angel. I have rested myself. I know what he went through with. I was with Moses mm. when he went down in Egypt. Mm. I was with Moses the burning bush. Hallelujah! Mm. Any person that has no burning bush experience is not a Christian, should not take one shower. Mm. To mix the mountain wash, should we not even marry? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's why you see hells at homes. Because, because Helen's married. Helen's married. married. Or people that will become Christian. That's right. I was with Moses of the burning bush. If you are a Christian, you are identified with the Bible characters. Don't forget it. I was with Moses when the people turned against him. I was with Moses when he closed the Red Sea. Hallelujah. Yeah. So, what every Christian has been, what every believer has been, every believer now is identified with the same person. Can you say, Amen? Don't forget that. Mm. So let the mind be sober. Don't forget that. When you do, when you forget, you have got spiritual amnesia. You have forgotten who you are. Hallelujah. I was with the light. In the days of her, when they had to make a choice who they would serve, God or Balaam, we was with him on Mount Carmel. When he had to make this choice, for we are identified in the body of the same God. That he was identified in. So if we are identified in that body, then we must remember we were there with him. Yeah. Ah. Now, I was in with David. Yeah. When he was rejected by his own brethren. Yeah. When they told him, you young boy, you have come too much. You are not even trained. You have no army garments. You have no army weapons. And you see everybody is walking, uh, begging. Because, because the enemy is saying, that one person is stand up. <laughs> And you are talking to us standing. <laughs> this is not looking after the sheep. There is something else. Then he said, Come on! What are you trying to tell me? So you came here. <laughs> so you came here in the army to waste time and to eat our money. You cowards! Where is the general? I want to see so. How can he allow this to happen in the army of, of God? The other day, a lion came to eat my father's sheep. I hold, got hold of it and I killed it with my, not a human being, a lion. Yeah. 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 Ye
Nonsense. Nonsense. Take me to the general. When someone gets the Holy Ghost, he talks to general like he's the general of generals. That's right. That's right. He does not care. Mr. General. Wait. You tell me you can allow this to happen here. Give me opportunity. Sign. I hear you have to sign. Please sign here immediately. That man, this is the last day. He is going to insult the army of the Almighty God. Yeah. Ah. I am identifying that character. Yeah. What about this one now? Mm. I was with, with the Hebrew children. Mm. In the very furnish. Mm. When the fire could not burn them because of the presence of the fourth man. Mm. I was with Daniel in the lion's den. Mm. You know? You know what these people did? They they disregarded the after afternoon bullet news that no more church gathering. They said, "Tell others, not me." True. Uh, Daniel was in the parliament when they passed that law. Daniel, I didn't book him. I came to see him. He did not regard age. No. Ah, Dana, Makwani, Okuru. He did not regard social distance. Ah, Dana, Takira, what did he do? He said, "The way I've been worshiping my God, I will put some more strength now, since the devil has come so much." Remember the problem was not the government. The problem was not the king. The king was so much afraid because Daniel was his friend. But what happened? But the other people that under another religion passed the law. Brother, we fell somewhere on the way. Nothing should have stopped our normal worship the way we are told by church order. Nothing should have gone astray. It's a time, it's a time we should ask God once more, oh Lord. And repent, and repent, and repent. Because no virus, no demon should have even altered, altered, or even it's better we were identified with Daniel, with the Hebrew, with the Hebrew children, and be taken to jail or be quarantined. That should have happened. That should have gone in history like those guys. People who are don't care. No fear at all. Let it happen whatever it happened. But the way our form of worship cannot change. How many are gentlemen with that? Amen. 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 That's why you can't raise your hands. Because you are still sick. We are still sick. I'm not putting myself out of the way. I am part of the system that fell. I'm part. In fact, I have even in bigger account, big accounts. As a leader, I should have seen that a long time ago. Amen. So, <laughs> I am counted to have bigger mistakes. <laughs> now, Daniel, 
I was most sure with him at Calvary. Mm. I must be entangled with him at Calvary. Mm. You know, <laughs> you know, people love so something so much until you can't put them uh, rose. <laughs> You know, yesterday we had a wedding here. Was there any social distance? Mm. So maybe you have COVID now. <laughs> and if there, is, there was none, let's just think, we think. We are, we are fearing nothing. If we never feared yesterday, mm. can I do it? If yesterday you went because of love of wedding, not God, not God, not God, no, you squeezed yourself. And you forgot whether there is COVID. Why do you remember when you come to church? And you are so much afraid. Let us be anxious, right? There is no black, white. At the wedding church. And key, no problem. Let's, you know, how, how, how are we going to do it? Let, let people stay. I mean, they are the same people. Same place. It could not be, not yesterday, it was not COVID. Today, it's when it is COVID. There's nothing like that. And, you know, <laughs> I read yesterday on the newspaper <laughs> that uh, somebody went to the president of Uganda because COVID has begun to raise up in Uganda. And he told him what God has told him. A vision from God. And Museven said, because of that, that was told, there is going to be a national prayer day. And I say, that is a right decision. That, that he never consulted from the people that are known. What, what do you do? But some who believe to be spiritual went to the key, to the president and told him God has given him a vision called a national prayers meeting. God will secure us. That was him. That, that, don't do that. That, that is a small tick. A small tick. Why I call small tick? Because there is one like him in Tanzania says COVID cannot attack the body of Christ. And that is nothing but amen. And in bringing instruction, if you see somebody looking uh, like uh, brother, brother, brother. Ah, it might be the name of the brother. This brother with mask, very big mask. Uh, Our sister Nyaga. Uh, ah, this is. <laughs> well, you know, sometimes when, when my hand, my hand goes uh, goes short, I don't remember names of people. Like you are only following the brother Nico. The brother Nico with mask. Uh, uh, Police put him inside. <laughs> In Tanzania, you wear a mask, you are arrested. In Kenya, you don't wear a mask, you don't wear, you are arrested. Are we living in the same half? Tanzania, we wear a mask, we wear a Kenya, we wear a mask, we wear a mask, we wear a mask. Anyway, we must be identified with people that are in the Bible. Is that right? Now, 
So we must be identified with him at Calvary. I was there when he died. I died with him. I was with him when he reached out from the dead. Hallelujah. Amen. And now, Amen. now, Amen. you get all from there to now. Amen. I am sitting with him in heavenly places in Christ with Jesus. Amen. With all the powers of hell conquered. All powers of hell yes. conquered through him. Every Christian believer was seated the same way because you have to be identified. Now, now, I find myself in these last days. With the many of the believing Christians identified in his ministry. He is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Mm -hmm. Do you find yourself that way? Believing it? Walking with it? Notice. How do you know you are identified? Rather, let's get out of talking. Yes. Let's get to business. Do you find yourself in the same talk? Notice to find whether you are in tune. He said, if you are identified, the works that he did. He said the believer would do the same thing. The works that I do shall you us you also. Then you can you you can you be identified with him. To be identified is not what we have read. It is to do same works that they did because of the same power. Then when the reproaches come on the word, you can stand the reproach like he did. See? Identified with him. I was identified with him. Oh I was with him Amen. at the day of Pentecost. Amen. That's why any person can be against what happened, but I am identified with it. I am part of it. You, de you don't talk me out things of my family. No. I know them. Hallelujah. Yeah. You can't teach me things of my family. I need to teach you. Yeah. I am born there. Yeah. I was in I'm identified with this day. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So you don't teach me and you are not born of it. Yeah. Don't get into that. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. How many people are identified with that day? Yeah. I was with him yeah. at the day of Pentecost. Yeah. I was with the disciples up there. Yeah. Identified with them in the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Yeah. And Brother Bram said, I wonder if the church hasn't got amnesia. Yeah. So much. Now that they don't, they don't. Some of them don't even believe there is such a thing as the as the Holy Ghost. Mm -hmm. Can you imagine? Mm -hmm. Any people kicking that out and and they they say and they bring other things and trying to say that there is a message of the day. Mm -hmm. 
Yes, that is always there. Yes. But how do you do it this day? Yes. And it must be identified with it. Yes. That is when God gave power, gave his life to his body. Amen. 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 That is when he put his life into the body. This is the resurrection. You can't resurrect without the Holy Ghost. See? Where the church has got. See? How sick this church is. I'm a very bad case of amnesia. A very bad case. Yes. They have forgotten that Jesus Christ back there. Yes. They have forgotten what Jesus Christ was. Yes. They have forgotten. They thought he was just a room maker or a prophet or a good man. And they forgot that he is the same yesterday, today, and forever. Yeah. And the church has got a bad case of spiritual amnesia. Mm. They have forgotten all these things. They don't understand it no more. Mm. They don't understand. No. We must be we must be with the disciples at Pentecost. Identify with them. I was identified with the Peter Samuel. On the day uh, on the day of Pentecost in Act 2 chapter. I heard what he said. I believe what he said. I obey what he said. Hallelujah. Can we say amen? Now I am identified in the same thing. Don't get spiritual blessing. Because you will, you identify yourself with something else. Stay light with that one. And the people want to tell you another one. Which one? And they tell you, don't forget that one. If you do, you will have a blessing. I was with the church. Mm. When it was commissioned by Jesus Christ. Amen. You realize yesterday I said, by the commission of the Almighty God. Amen. Amen. In Acts 16 chapter, that we are commissioned. Go into the world. Preach the gospel to every creature. I want to be identified there. All the to every creature. And this sign shall follow them that believe. Well now, are you identified with that? Or have you got some spiritual amnesia mm. that you don't find out, you don't believe those signs follow the believers? Mm. Mm. If you don't believe it, then you have spiritual amnesia. Mm. You have forgotten that God promised that. God said, These signs shall follow them that believe. Don't forget it. You can't forget it and be a Christian. You forget that, you are no more Christian. You must be identified in John 14, 12. He that believeth with me, the works that I do shall you do also. Don't forget it. If you do, then you go spiritual amnesia. You have forgotten who you are. You forgot your testimony means. Uh, 
You forgot your testimony. Means. Don't look at the people, drunkards, who they have forgotten who they are, who they are. They have done that naturally. But you, you have forgotten spiritually who you are. And that's the case of whether women or not, there is such a thing in the They are like dogs. They are out of their mind. Yeah. Then similarly, we are the same, spiritually speaking, when we forget these promises of God. How about he saying, if you are binding me and the one in you, you ask whatever you will and it shall be done for you. Mm. Mm. Are you intent to there? there? Are you a masking? Yes. Are you intent to find there? Yes. Are you intent to find there? Yes. To believe that that is the truth? Yes. Mark 11, he said, yes. if you say to this mountain, yes. be moved, yes. and don't doubt in your heart, yes. but believe that what you have said will come to pass. Yes. That you can have what you said. Remember, Brother Bram told us faith is a master of all circumstances. If something is obstructing to do God's work, maybe a mountain, please, if you believe this word, if you identify it, tell it. Get it out of the way. Sure. How it will go, it is not your work. No. If somebody is sick, mm-hmm. cast the demon. Yeah. How it will go, it is not your work. Yeah. But you must be believing you have done what God said. Yeah. And you are identified with that. Yeah. The rest is not yours. Yeah. It was not the work of Peter to remain, to keep himself walking on the water. It was the work of who caught him. Amen. No. No person can walk on water. But the one caught him, come and he walked. But once you doubt, it can't happen. So this is a place for whatever come. If God said it, whatever come, I don't care. If you forget whatever we are talking, yes. you lose your Christian balance. We are going to be Christian. We are going to be a Christian. That's true. You can't tell where, where you belong. And you start saying you, come, you belong to the church. As if the church will take people to heaven. You must be in the body of Christ, not this church. Amen. Watch out. That may mean that the disease sign is showing on you. <laughs> And you got some spiritualness. Mm. And you say, well, Brother Branham. I believe this. I don't handle it. Now, wait a minute. If God promised to do these things, and say they will be in the last days, and you are clean, you keep you from it. That is a good sign. I can see the disease sign on you. It's a spiritual mess. You have forgotten to identify yourself with the world. You say, 
Okay. I don't believe that sick are healed. You got spiritual blessing. You say, okay. I don't believe in the baptism of the Holy Ghost. Spiritual blessing. You say, okay. I don't believe that God promised to do these things in the last days. What you have done, you have listened to a clean or some doctrine instead of the Bible. You have spiritual blessing. You don't know where you do belong to. You are confessing that you are a Christian and denying the word. And it brings you back to spiritual ministry again. See? And you don't know where you stand. You go spiritual ministry. You have to be with the disciples. You have to be with the scripture. With the church when it's commissioned. Going so hard. This thing shall fall them that believe. That was a commission. But they, but they have gotten a bad case of this spiritual amnesia. Just like if God around the garden one day and she is like he's uh, suffering from the same disease an allergy from seminal diet that will give you spiritual pleasure amen <laughs> <laughs> Get some seminary diet. Uh, you get an analogy. Okay, mm -hmm. And the first thing you know, you got amnesia real bad. Sure. Now, And you don't believe anything the Bible says. Okay, you doubt what the Bible says. Now it's noon. Maybe for 15 minutes. Okay, right? This uh, minister something. The remedy to no, no. healing of mind. Because it's a long thing now. Let's my And before you go, there, do you feel to be identified? Yes. 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 Now, if you are a brother started with America, he was trying to show them because they are American. And he showed me what American is to be an American What it means to be an American. And there's something that they know natural. Then he told me, just like I've told you, like an American, like a Kenyan. Let's go to be a Christian. Because now, out of America, now we are Christian. Then he brought all the Bible characters. Bible characters. And he should have mentioned Noah. How Noah said, God has told me, the heart has come to an end. The foolishness, you people you know in your homes. Every child now, when the schools were closed, they have become almost all pregnant. And those that are not pregnant, they have become women. Now, I don't think they have Some of their mothers, they have taken them to the clinic to be injected. They will never give you back to begin with. Watch out! Watch out! Let the women and the sin give birth. Come on, man, I'm a shiari. Say amen. Never try to abort. Look at me, you can't do that. When I'm skipping in a second. Abortion is is murder. Yes. I mean, our children are not Christian. They can do that. 
So be identified without the shame. It is in your home. Oh, let's let go to your heart. Yes. If it is your son, accept to be identified with the shame. You can't say it's not mine. Who do you be identified with? So in the days of Noah, that is what was happening. And God, God was anointed. He said, I will finish these people. Even in the church, they, 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 they are shouting in the church. And dating in the church. And God got so much annoyed. And told Noah, Noah, I'm going to finish this generation. But tell them. It's a damn man, God who is full of mercy. If they can repent of their sin. And you go and build a mark. Those that will get it, I will save them. But the conditions were very serious. <laughs> because it meant those who want to be president, they stop campaigning. And follow Noah to the forest. Yes. Those who want to be members of parliament and governors, stop their nonsense for Noah. Those who, those who want promotion at their place of work, and this and that, and in big business, and farming, you close your shops, close your farm Amen. for a Noah. That is what Noah is supposed to say. And, <laughs> so, and you know he never started by stop. He started by half time you close those business and your farm, let's go at this particular day, what let's go and cut. You know it was a like today. And the worst of all is what he said. And close on government affairs and schools. And they said that cannot happen. But it has happened in our day. Schools have been closed. Yes. Yes. So it can happen. So what, okay. so what now say, people could not think, but condition has made many people to know we can close them. Yes. Even big business being closed. Yes. Can you imagine closing my airline? Mm -hmm. What kind of investment is in that? Do you know how much is to, you know how much is to buy an airplane? Mm -hmm. Then, then they, they, without conditions, they say it's better. Let, let it stay there. So can you imagine what Noah is telling the people? So can you imagine what Noah is telling the people? That with that kind of a condition, please find your time. We go to the forest. I will show you what kind of a tree to cut. But they were never ready before. Mm. I would say today, it was a neon demon. Who could comprehend what is this? Mm. I believe one of the wife of maybe Ham. When God the mother, no, Well, they are cooking for the people that are in the forest. And mother, now, I am not doubting. But what is? The dish we have been burnt here by fire. Looking for these people. 
As my father told me exactly what he means by it. And please, because me I can't ask him. Ask him so that today I am here. Has there any, any person or not that whoever is calling God that he talked to him at the end by is here? Ask him. I'm not the one who asked. Dina, Dina, Malanga, you know what? Dere, Walwe, Tere, Wane, Kwamondo, Okuwa, No, Are, Wene, Kiloge, Takwang, Kai. But she was claiming she is not doubting, but that is what is doubting. I'm not Dina, Malanga, you know what? Malanga, Wene, Malanga, Ni. What was coming into her mind to ask that kind of a question was doubt. To question is what is doubt. Because the word of the Lord and the saint, and what the word of the Lord has said was over, cannot be, cannot be re-examined. Hallelujah! <laughs> Who can examine the mind of God? Who can examine what the one says? When the one said it knew what to do with whoever who will believe it. Do you want to hear? Thank God that you are not born in that day, for you will not be part of the age. Yes. Uh, uh. But you have been born in a day which is very worse, for it is as it was in that day. Amen. So, what are you going to do? Amen. 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 People who are just around, they are not far. I don't know what you are saying. They cannot waste their time coming to fellowship. They are very senior. Maybe, I don't know. But think it's not a show. But you can go out and know. Their business is so big. And they don't care. No matter how much. So suddenly they come and they make us even destroy the world so that they can be accommodated. You may be in one of our No matter what, 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 the matter was. We get out of fellowship and we find you just hanging around. Uh, not uh, that you are far. Not that you are far. We understand. God has understand. There's some people that, are, that come from very far. Surely. 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 Surely, no, I will still be identified. No, I'm not And to make the matter worse, if you asked what was happening yesterday or on Friday, you can't say because not even coming, even you can't stream. Yes, okay, don't get it. No, no, I don't think I woke up. I don't Ah, ah. I don't know how to do that. 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 I to be identified with where you come from. Don't you think you are sick? Yes. I'm asking a honest question. Let's see. First things in the reality. 
This is the only remedy. Is this thing on my losing power? Or this is the only remedy. Romans chapter 12. Are you following, brethren? Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I'm not yet. So don't even get worried. And be sure I will stay here on several days on the pulpit. And the character is attained by your attitude and how much you are you suffer. Na mutugo koma karagia we moshere wa kugea kiri ni atia. Na 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 he says like this, 12 verse 1. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that you present your bodies as a living sacrifice, Amen. holy, acceptable unto God, which is your reasonable service. Sure. Reasonable service. Sure. Number two. And be conformed to this world. And, and be not conformed to this world. Sorry. But ye transformed by the renewing of your mind Amen. that you may prove what is that good and acceptable sure. and perfect will of God. Namatka Nahana ni Horowa yu Nawandu Aho Kozi No Redi Mogaruke Kondongi Nyodwa Roshia Nyu Modon de Ko Meshi de Mashio Bakeru Hio Negumotake Kwimen Rakuna Maromaria Brethren, are you? Can we agree that our mind need to be transformed? Amen. We are not thinking right. If we say, if we say, we will make the one a liar. We have read what identification means. So let us go by God's word and agree that his word may transform us by the renewing. We are renewed. Our mind is renewed. And Brother Abraham said in the message, God's power to transform, he said. Now, this word transformed. I looked up in the dictionary yesterday. And in the dictionary, it says that it's something that's been changed. It's to be changed, transformed. Made different than what it was. So, the way our mind has been, it's been renewed to be now thinking otherwise. And you know this mind, what is it? It's, it's been, it, it's, it's character and everything has been changed in it. To renew is to innovate. And when you are not coming to church, and we were streaming because the government had said don't come, and we followed the government election, 
and he stopped worshiping the way we used to worship. You should have come and said, Is this our church? Because it doesn't look like that one. Because here at the, at the front face, it was renovated. How many people were not coming to church and when they come to church they found it like this? Why, why, why can't you raise up your heart? Uh -huh. So when you came in your mind, you will not see some, something has been done. When they came for, when they came the first time. What we did is innovation. Because the streaming we are doing here could not go well with our own war. No, no. We go to a shagana camera. We go to a torani lega. And we put. This right here to make it like a, a studio. Because if we don't do that, you'll be seeing black, black images. Saying, is that Brother Ray or who is it? Are you understanding? Amen. So we need this innovation so, so that at least we can have a good streaming. And because we have put a lot of heat here, we also put a fan here. Though we realize this one is affecting my brother. So I decided to go by his will. Let me, let me feel the heat. It cannot be you. Are you following? Yes. So all this we did is to innovate mm. so that we can have some, something better. So your mind needs to be innovated like that. Yes. So that you are thinking will mm. oh, now be changed. Amen. It's a complete change for the better. Yes. And what has been renovated is your mind. So that you can have the power of considering mm. and judging somebody. Come ah. When you, when you hear the word, you consider it with an innovated mind, not the old mind. And you judge it somebody. No, and calmly, and impartially, it's the word of the Lord. Your mind is innovated until you say, if it is that says the Lord, if the Bible says I walk through that wall, I walk it. Hallelujah. Our mind must be transformed until we have all the confidence in the word of the Lord. Just like we have a confidence in a doctor. Amen. 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 Our mind to have that. Calmness, sobriety, 
We, we our men, our men, we know what to do. We show them and take and take. Must be renovated. Amen. And God placed that one in his hand. He knew. No, I see. One day we will require innovation. Let's go out here. Go down the road. Go up. Where up? Why? Nigga. But Abraham said, Abraham, what you got? In the great church, Abraham, holy church, Abraham, can you show millennium modern? He arrives his power to do the these things. We have read them. When you come on to this, now that Abraham can you show millennium modern? You can't ask which things we have read, which we need to be identified with. John 14, Mark 4, 12, 11, Mark 16, we have read them. Is that right? But we can't do them. There is so much doubt and fear. And trembling and wondering. Where are we wondering? In our mind. Where are we doubting? In our mind. And we are wondering. Oh, what the Bible is saying. Even if we could not happen. Can we tell our mountain to be moved? Well, who else intended? Can we tell our mountain to be moved? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As much, there is much doubt and fear and trembling and wondering if it will, could it happen? As long as that exists, the church can never stand upright. We cannot stand upright. We cannot have any record of another book of act. You know, we should live until by our, our life write another book. Yes. Is what Prabhupada said. Yes. Our lives yes. should write another book. Yes. The life, yes. not papers. Mm. The life. Yes. That's right. Yeah. That's true. Amen. Church. Mm. But there's a lot of fear. Mm. And trembling. Sure. And sure. doubt. Mm. And wondering whether these things can be. As long as that exists Amen. in our mind, the church can never stand upright. Like. And when every talk of fear is furnished, yes. the Holy Ghost Spirit, the Holy Spirit is completely in control of the church. Then all fear are gone. And that church has the power. Hallelujah. Why? They have everything that happens, heaven's uh, oaths behind them. They are ambassadors of the throne, absolutely. True. And an ambassador of Christ has authority. Now, Everything that Christ owns belongs to that ambassador. And he said, now, go into the world. You are my witnesses of the Holy Ghost has come upon you. And what is a witness? Is an ambassador. Is to come and witness something. So, for him to witness, the whole powers of heaven is right with our hearts. Amen. Now, oh, why do we sit and the church is barren? And we see dormant. 
Kotario no way, no reason to No, is it true? No, my account. Ah, I have who can be a get your hand, get thing you make. There is money in the account. When I'm beer, but it has been dormant. It has not have anything happening for the last one year. No, I think again, I could get a get it and get it to carry it out to a Mwaka Mugima. No exercise has happened on this account. What did you want to say? Come on, yes, no activity. What are you doing? The whole year, we have not casted any demon. Yeah, we have not casted any demon. The account has not been active. Sure. Yeah. Uh, uh. Then you come to the church. Then you hear what the one says. And you decide today. I am going to do something. It is dormant. Okay, uh. You have to activate that account. Sure. How many of the what I mean? Brother, our accounts from heaven, they are dominant. We even forgot whether we have those accounts. We are suffering with the accounts are full. Ask whatever you want and it shall be given. No, and it shall be opened. See, and you shall fight. We have forgotten. We are sick. We need innovation. We need the innovation of our mind. We can't start now developing how our character is developed. Otherwise, it, is, it, is not, it can't work. Let's stop there. <laughs> but brethren, <laughs> our accounts are dominant. Dominant does not mean there is nothing. How many of us have an account that was dominant at one time? People, people who receive their salary through account, they always have, that's, those accounts are always active. But the people who, go, who have a saving account and they go to deposit by themselves, if they are not disciplined. I don't know what I'm saying, I'm going to go to the bank, I'm going to go to the you might keep on not going there and eat money. And you know, you left some money there. So, you know, 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 you you know, you know, you know, you know, you Account, yeah. Because there is your money there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But what will happen? No, 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 no. They will declare to dormant. No, no, no. It's not active. No, no, no. And, uh, and, uh, and, uh, there is no activity. Mm -hmm. we, we don't know whether this man died or not. So, we, 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 we make it dormant. Or, in other words, we, we, we will temporarily stop it. And if wait for any person who will come to claim it. So when you will come, you will be asked, who are you? So you know what will happen? <laughs> they might even ask for many things. Even the KRIP. It's like you are reopening. Brethren. 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 Let's make sure our mind is renovated. 
so that we so that we can know when to deposit and when to withdraw. Otherwise, we are suffering when our heavenly account is full. And you don't even know. That's true. Just like this political circle. Even after you see all that you said. The father was still a rich man. That is not so. <laughs> so when he came, even the father said, it's not a, a good a, a good boy. And he closed him nice. He did not know whether or not it's going to be done. Can we can can two up together unless they agree? I not know how to do it. Let us come and listen together. Amen. And as we listen with, the, with our God, He will transform our minds by renewing them. Amen. And we stop thinking the way we think. We will think heavenly. God bless you. We have come to the end of the service. So don't don't feel don't feel bad. Okay, when I because sing song number forty five. Sing from your heart. Living on everlasting hearts. Can you stand up? Ah, before before you stand up, I, I, just, I, I, I just forgot. That, uh, sometime, Brother Kennedy, I think everybody knows Brother Kennedy. Brother You all know him. How many know him? Okay, I told you. So he came to me and told me, brother, I have found a place I can now call home. And uh, I told him, that's all right. That's what I want to say. So, uh, I told him even I will talk with the pastor so that he can, can be accepted there in a, in a good way. So he has been fellowshipping at Mombasa, at Ukuda Church. So now he came again. He never wanted to talk on the phone. And he told me, brother, I want to advise. I still feel to be identified in the three church. What do I do? I told him it's your decision. Pastors don't decide on people. And with the criteria as a pastor, we don't want members. Did you hear that? <laughs> that can go to everybody. If, if you want to make a choice, you'll be going to another church. You come to me, I help you to go. The fewer we are, the fewer the, the easier to manage. Because Many people in the church have different opinion, many ways of doing things. Some, if you know them, you cannot know whether they are behaving like human beings. So, so today in the morning we were talking that on uh, on uh, Friday night. 
So today it will be brother. I made up my mind and also to the church. I have come back. I, I, want to, I, I want to be identified there again. So brother, welcome to the church. So this is always a home of people who believe in God and who want to be identified with the Bible. Because if you happen to come here because of a good sermon, the other day it will hit you very hard. And you will say that the way it was good, it will be equally good on the other side. When it comes to those lives, it will be equally good. Many people tell me, <laughs> we went for a minister's meeting at Kitui, then one brother said, Brother has preached as if there is nothing else to preach. So I said, Brother, And because it was on Holy Ghost and the Pentecost, he said, it's a, and, and, it, it's, and, and it is as if there is no other way. So the next meeting, I asked the chairman, why don't you ask that brother to speak on the other day, the other way he talked? Then he refused. Then I wondered what was he talking about? Now that this is my nature and you all know that. That when I'm on something, if it is good. If it is favoring you, you enjoy it. If it is backfiring, you think I am not right. It is the same ability. Now, I use the same ability on which way? You understand? So, remember, I am only that way. So, brother, if you if you'll be able to agree with our conditions here, welcome. You know me, I have no friends. Give the one Ask Simon. Simon? Ask my brother. When is something back fire? <laughs> Simon will tell you. He said, it's better, it's better, brother, we finish. That's, what we, that's how we talk. Let's finish, brother, we, if it is not the one, brother, you can stop. What is your name? 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 What is You know what happened with uh, Peter and, uh, and Paul? Yeah. All the time those things will happen. What is your name? Petro na Paulo on issues, not on the word. Taking one, he mount Rory. And even you, 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 you talk like that. Even you. So, so brother, I welcome to the church. We all come back. And be praying for my brother. He told me he, he would wish to be coming here at least, if possible, one or twice. Then we say, if lockdown, no, if curfew is abolished, and if, if, if uh, there is no fear, and the buses are start carrying to their capacity, then from bus to Kiritini, it's just short time. They are coming through this route. Yeah. You remember I preached three months here coming from Mombasa? 
So I would come in the evening, be here in the morning, preach in the evening, and go again to the morning, Monday morning, and work. It, it, it depends on your commitment. And what you find. So we pray for my brother. He has not the desire. God bless you. So let us pray. Our precious Heavenly Father, we love you, Father. All what you have spoken to us is because of love. Because love is collective. We have not done you the way we should have done you. But Lord Jesus, we feel deeply guilty in our hearts. But Lord Jesus Christ, we are ready to repent whatever that we have done wrong. Lord Jesus, as your children, we don't want to be sick. We want our mind to be refitted. We want to think right. We want to take your word the way it is, it is written, the way it has been said, the way the tapes are said. Father, let us not divert. Let us not get left or right. Let us only be at the middle of your word. Father, we are not better like, than other churches or other children of God. But, that, oh, but because, Lord, we find ourselves not doing right, forgive us, Lord. And we thank you because you said the other day, the blood of the Lamb is on the mercy seat. Amen. That we can confess our iniquity. Amen. And that's why you sent Amos to Israel and telling them they are the only people, they are the only families that you know on earth. But they are doing not right. And they are the only people that has believed the message that they have said. You have no other children. We are the only children of the Almighty God. Renew our mind that we can see things the way they should be. Lord Jesus, we have ourselves before you. That we might allow our souls and our bodies to die daily before you. That we can be able to be renovated by you, Lord. Let the Holy Ghost be our guide. Let the Holy Ghost be our leader. And Lord Jesus Christ, we shall come victorious. Father, we have talked about our brother who has seen it fit to come back to where he has been for several years, Lord. We all know him. He's a dear brother. We love him. And we pray, Lord, since he has a need and he is living far from here, Lord. And you know, one sister's son and say, they come from east and west. Father, we don't know how many people who come here from far. But I'm praying, Lord, whoever will send to be a member here, no matter how far you be, provide for him. You are the same God who provided for your son Abraham. You are Jehovah Jireh in all means. I commit his desires into your holy hands, Father. And I'm telling my brother, I commit every brother and every sister here, Lord. You know their desires. You know why some don't have to, well, they fail to come maybe on a Friday. Maybe why some don't come on a Sunday. Maybe some don't have fear. I don't know. But Lord Jesus Christ, provide for them. Renovate their mind that they can make other decisions, Lord, to serve you in a better way. Help us as we go home. Help us as we go to do our business. Help us, Lord, as we go to our works. That we may do them, knowing we are doing it on behalf of our Lord Jesus Christ. Therefore, we will do it with all what is in our heart. Heavenly Father, I want to commit our children into our hearts, Lord. I know there are tempt temptations of teenagers. Father, I commit them to you, Lord. Those who are not coming to church, Lord, my, like my son, boss, Lord, on this pulpit, I want to commit him to you, Lord. You are the one who gave me him, Lord. He is a member of my family. Father, I commit him together with him, maybe any other brother or any other sister who may have a son or whom you want to commit to you, Lord. Just like Brother Bram said to his wife, Let's commit Rebecca into the hands of God. He is the one who brought him here. Yes. 
I want to commit our children into your hands, Father. That you may renovate their mind. That they may come to their senses and know their family name. That they may know we have been called by the Almighty God to some God. That's why we have a privilege to be here on earth. We want to commit all things to you now. For in Jesus' name, Father, I pray. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. What a fellowship. Give us a song, song number five. Yeah. Hey. 